Hello. <laughs> Tristram Campbell? Oh, you probably don't remember me. I was the producer when we did Songs of Praise. No, of course I remember you. <laughs> do, do, come in. Go through. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry to disturb you. This is crazy, but Christmas makes one do crazy things. Yeah, it certainly does. I mean, look at the three wise men. <laughs> Tricking thousands of miles just to bring a baby a couple of bottles of perfume. <laughs> <laughs> Quite, sir. Uh, well, it, it's just that a... Uh, oh, heck. I know I've only met you the once, but I've never been able to get you out of my mind. And, well, I think you're perfect. So I just wondered if you'd marry me. <laughs> I wonder if you'd marry me. Yes, I thought that's what you said. <laughs> and then I thought... <laughs> You mean you actually want me to decide now? No, no, well, of course not, but it's just... if you could find it in your heart to say yes, and you'll make me the happiest man alive, and I'll love you forever. <gasps> well... Uh, well, then, yes. I mean, yes. Fantastic. <laughs> Back in a sec. from the moment he saw me, forsaking all others. Oh, utterly obsessed with me. Well, I'm afraid you're gonna have to butt oh, out, God. Mel. Where's the crowd, babe? Oh, I'm, I'm gonna put this on. He loves it when I'm cute. <laughs> This is Aoife. I didn't bring her in just now, in case you said no, but, well, she'd love to meet you. Hello, Eva. Aoife. 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 Yes, E, whatever. <laughs> and, and you are? Tristram's fiance. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> no, of course you are. Of course you are. Do come in. Through the fire's on. <laughs> Drink! Thank you. Yeah, Thank please. Aoife's been dying to meet you. Has she? <laughs> Has she? <laughs> I always said if I ever got married, then the only person I'd want to marry me was Geraldine Granger. Superb. Superb. Well, here's to love and marriage which go together like a horse and carriage, according to Cole Porter. He should know, he was gay. <laughs> Here's to Tristram and his young heifer. <laughs> this is a strange name, isn't it? <laughs> How do you spell that? A-O-I-F-E. Oh, I haven't bothered to leave any vowels for anyone else, then. <laughs> you greedy hussy. <laughs> Actually, actually, there's no you in it. I once, the soppy thing that I am, I, I, oh, left, no. I left a message for Aoife. Aoife, missing you always. <laughs> <laughs> That's lovely, isn't it? <laughs> and then I thought, actually, everything is better in the village since the vicar arrived. Oh, Alice, but, thank um, you. And I thought, I wonder if the vic knows it, so... I thought she probably doesn't know it. Oh, oh, no, who can that be? Not another Scottish sadist and his Irish tart come round to talk to me. <laughs> well, as I was saying, I thought she probably doesn't know, so I went round oh, and asked right, everyone. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know what to say. Yeah, I do. What's that, Jim? Charades. Oh, oh, right. 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 And anyone who does that disgusting mime for Gone with the Wind is straight back out again. <laughs> The catering vicar, we've all got together and produced a rather splendid selection of turkey sandwiches. Oh, for me, I don't think. Do have one, vicar. We put so much effort into it. Now, some of them have got cranberry jelly, some yes. of them have got pickle lily. We've been at it all afternoon. Oh, all right, then. 
I don't think I should, really. <laughs> no, just as I thought. Big mistake. Excuse me. <laughs> it's definitely a film. Yes. And it is one word. Yes. Give up? Yes. yes. It's jars. Jars? <laughs> I've not seen it, but apparently it's about these big jars that attack people. Jars, the stupid girls talking yeah, about yeah, jars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right, right. Settle down, settle down, settle down. No, no. <clears throat> now, I, I'm not a great speech maker. Get so nervous, I usually start gibbering absolute talkish. Uh, I, I, I just wanted to say, this village didn't amount to doodle squat before the vicar arrived, uh, and now it's a fantastic place to live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. She's the first person ever to make me feel genuinely desirable. <laughs> exactly, Owen. So uh, I'd like you all to raise your glasses to our own dear vicar. <laughs> to the vicar. The vicar. The vicar! And we hope she soon recovers from what seems to have been a truly sensational bout of indigestion. <laughs> Thanks a lot. I should be out just after New Year. <laughs> hello, vicar. Oh, hello, Frank. I'd like to audition for one of the wise men. Oh, right, lovely, right. Well, here's the script. Yes. I'll read in the other wise men for you, shall I? Right, yes. All right. <clears throat> Ready? Here we go. Lo, behold, a wondrous star in the east. Let us follow it, <laughs> my noble companion. <laughs> Chance we will encounter the Son of God. Then we will <laughs> worship him. Interesting interpretation, Frank. Can't say I quite understand the voice. <laughs> well, I was just thinking, I'm playing a wise man. Now, who's wise? And I thought, of course, Stephen Hawking. <laughs> about this, Frank. <laughs> More's the pity. Um, can I call you about it? It's very good, though. Thank you. <laughs> right, who's next? It's Owen. Excellent. Can you send him in? Yes. Owen. <laughs> to audition for... The King. Of course, there were three kings, and you are obviously one of them. That's right. <laughs> and will you be giving us an Elvis impression on the night? Well, it would be mad to dress up as him and then not lay down some serious rock and rolling. <laughs> are you lonesome tonight? Do you miss me? Tonight. Can I get back to you on it? Just store that performance and come back to you. Certainly. All right. Would it help if I slept with you? <laughs> I beg your pardon? Well, I've heard you can get on in acting by sleeping with the director on a couch. <laughs> and I, for one, would be only too happy to oblige. Um, no. <laughs> Who's next? It's Jim. He's come as one of the kings as well. Oh, right. Well, I hope it isn't Martin Luther King. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> he says he'll come back later. So, how can I help you two? We'd like to play Mary and Joseph. <laughs> With me as Mary. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, good! <laughs> Though, actually, Alice, Actually, was banking on you for the pivotal role of woman who sleeps through the entire thing in another room at the inn. 
That would be nice too, but I want to play Mary. <laughs> it's just that, oh dear, what a shame. You don't actually fit the vital requirements, I'm afraid. For instance, Joseph was a carpenter, and I'm afraid Hugo just isn't, is he? <laughs> Just finished them in evening class. Right. And so it was that the three wise men who looked remarkably like the shepherds, but who were in fact completely different people, approached the stable, riding camels, or at least doing very good camel riding impressions. <laughs> and as they came unto the manger, they saw Mary, who was extremely great with child and looking rather hot. And in the company of only some cattle <laughs> and her husband, Joseph. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jesus, she's having a baby. No, the line is, she's having a baby. Jesus. No, really, she is actually having a baby. Come <laughs> look. Excuse me, just one second. Thank you. <laughs> what are you doing? We've got them in the palm of our hands. Oh, ah. oh, God. oh my God! We must have some towels. Owen, run out to the house and get some towels. I haven't got any. Well, no towels. Well, why would I have towels? To dry yourself after a bath. I don't have a bath. <laughs> would anyone here have some towels? I suppose you could use these. My entire costume is made of towels. Right. <laughs> no, 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 sorry. Would you excuse us just one moment? Actually, is there a doctor in the house? I'm a vet. You'll do. Could you come and help? Over my dead body. I'm not having a grandchild of mine brought into the world by James Harriet. I mean, come on, it's common sense, sure. <sighs> Oh, dear, dear. Are you sure it's a good idea having Herod take care of Jesus? He's not Herod now. He's Mr. Horton. Oh, he is. <laughs> come on, little one. Push. Push. Oh, Gerald, uh, come on, give us a hand. Uh, right. right, Alice, oh. breathe. Oh, well, it hurts. Does it? Is it? Well, next time you get a contraction, you just hang on to my hand really tight, OK? Grip it. Okay. Tight as you like. It's coming. OK? OK. Here it comes. OK. Here it comes. OK. Here it comes. OK. Ooh, you bitch. Thank you. Oh, God, here comes another one. Oh, God, please. All right. <laughs> something we can do to help? I mean, after all, we are the three wise men. No, 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 we are the kings. Oh, right. And most kings are brain-dead in bread crittings. <laughs> mm. well, then, deep breathing. Deep, deeper. That's it. Good. Oh, oh here's Hugo. Oh. Here's Hugo. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There we are. Just, just one more push now. Oh, my God, I can see the head. God, I hope that is a head. <laughs> it's very realistic, isn't it? <laughs> it's coming. It's coming. 